What is up guys? As you can see on the screen now, Hunter Call of the Wild is finally here. And we're about to go on a whole new adventure. The music is really loud. Oh, we can jump. We can jump. I hope the music isn't too loud. We're about to start our new adventure and we have to choose what we want to look like. I think I'm gonna go with the sea. Reserves? Leighton Lake Districts or the Hirschfelden Hunting Reserve? We've tried the Hirschfelden plenty of times in uh, the classic version, so let's go with the Leighton Lake District. Well, thank you. There has to be some options. We do not like motion blur. I don't like that. Well, I think we should be good to go. That's better. Oh, and we can jump. We can jump. Track down and up. Something over there. Some mating coal. Oh, I'll bleed caller. Sounds like we have animals all over the place. Mm. Mm. Oh, we actually do. I suppose we'll just try to get... And that was our first kill. Pretty sure we scared everything else off now though. Ooh, we have the bear over there. Footprints. Well, this seems to be our first kill. Flesh, right lung and liver. This is definitely gonna take a bit of getting used to. We have something calling over here. Sounds like a bear. And we have a bear down there. He's also going down. Mm. Oh, so he's actually smelling me as well. Where did he go? Did I scare him up? This is not as easy as I thought it would be. Making a whole lot of noise, I see. Mm. 
So we're back in the game after our first crash, and we should be on the hunt for a black bear. For some reason I cannot change my controls, or key bindings and such, as, as it is at the moment. I think that was also what forced the crash. We have a bear running there. And for some reason I cannot toggle run off. So what can you do? And we have blood. Can't see which kind of blood though. Suppose we're just to follow This way. We have even more blood here. Oh, even small trees. Like there you are. And we have our bear here. But let's take a moment to appreciate this. I even had to turn down the graphic settings a little just to make it run a little bit more smooth. Um, also, I've removed the motion blur because. I really don't see why I want that. I don't know if this is any good. I got some XP reward. Distance was 73 meters. Weapon score barely 27. Hit it in the right long. Seems to be pretty good I suppose. And we got cash for this kill. Suppose this game is gonna be a lot of just learning by going. What is going on down here? What is that? Oh! I think we got it. There's blood at least. Vital hit. Should be alright, and it's over there. This is just... <laughs> it really does look stunning. Oh my god. And this should be our third kill for the game. I really don't get this. Why do I keep running? Fuck's sake. Reset to default. We have one skill point available. Stalker or ambusher? I think I'm gonna go with the stalker. So we just bend our first skill point and got even better at tracking. But we're now level 2. Oh, and I'm walking. Oh, amazing. I think it's working now. The mission said that we have to visit some kind of look outpost. And I think there should be one up here. Where are we? Right there. Place waypoint. That means we should be able to go there. Could probably just be running. I don't know if you actually gain anything by going around and collecting all the trots, all the footprints like you do in the Hunter Classic. Let me get up here please. Thank you. Does it seem to be a lot more skill based and leveling based? I don't really think you do gain anything from it. But on the other hand, while we're here we might as well just press them. Are we even on the right track? We are. What is that question mark? Hmm. I think it has something to do with our mission.
An animal has spotted me. What is this? Inspect. Oh, we got a skill point. And here it is. Our point of interest. I think it has... It should do something on the Hunter Made now, I expect it to do at least. That is a waypoint I put, I think. Have to get all the way up. I'm kind of bummed the weather is this bad. Would really like it to be sunny and clear, but hopefully get plenty of chances to actually see it like that. This has its charm as well. And we're here. I think this is going to be pretty much my baby steps into the corner of the wild. So far the view is amazing, it's really insane and I'm not even playing on ultra or anything, this is just basically medium graphics. I am so stunned upon it, it's insane. Uh, it's gonna take a lot of getting used to. For me, at the moment, the key binding seems to be a bit of an issue. Um, I did experience one crash, but that's not really any big thing in a, in a new game. I wouldn't expect anything less, at least. So, I hope you liked my little tour of seeing how noobish I can be in a new game as well. And for the future videos, I really do hope that you will tune back in. Uh, I've also got a giveaway going on the channel in one of the other videos. I'll put an annotation to it or something like that. Um, and until then, see you next time.